Yeah. Yeah. Uh, 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 okay. I think I think I figured it out though. So. Try it again. Child, you are risen. Nah, that's not really my style. Dance monkey. You don't even know why you're here, do you? Tell you what. If you can find my Engine temple, player. I might let you know what's going on. Engine player. Nice. Two more to go. I'm impressed. Nah. Another one. Great. Took you long enough. You think you could speed things up a bit? I haven't got all day here. I gotta look up more. Yep. I keep forgetting. No boost? No boost. I probably shouldn't be going for that boost, but that's okay. Oh boy, I did that again. I jumped with momentum, which is not what you want to do when you want to land on the, the top slippery you bit thing. The pieces that you need. Now, make your way to the temple. It's the big room with the... Uh, All right. Oh, bloody hell. You'll know it when you get there. Move along now. Yay. You found all the pieces in this area. Attention. Just step into disintegration and the monkey continues to dance. Hooy. All right, we're doing good. Oh, hey, one more as long as I don't fuck up AEP again. And checking out the scenery, you might notice a giant tower. I'm supposed to warn you about that. Uh, actually, Honestly, I'm glad that something stupid like that happened earlier in the run. If there was something where I had like a, a heater of a run and I fucking just forgot how to do it. This is amazing. I'm getting extremely good weird paint look. I had two first tries earlier and now I have a second try. Wow, that's good. Nice. Take a break and go play some serious Sam. Yeah, that was a shameless plug. This is me. I almost got pushed off course way too much there. Ooh. Gross. All right. Nice. Just barely making that one. I shouldn't be taking paint with me, but it, it's kind of reflexive and it also reduces my jump height there, so it works, I guess. Oh, come on. I haven't even gotten to the jump yet. You can't screw me out of being able to do the jump. Oh wow, double first tries. I will take that. <laughs> Oops. Nice. Okay. Hey, Pretzel Factory, what's up? Okay. <laughs> Good. Hell yeah. Oops, 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 oops. Okay. <laughs> Jesus. 
Alright. We're we're going again. Let me ask you a question. No AP thing? Alright. How do you define fun? Do you like Alright, second try we'll take it. <laughs> We are really having a fucking hard time with that. Jeez. No altar paint? Alright. If there was altar paint, there would have been a bit of an altercation. That's my pun of the day. Uh, thank you for coming. Uh, there we go. I have one good pun today. The blind run. Absolutely perfect run. The perfect pun. <laughs> Jesus, no. This is Ted Pun. Okay paint, which uh, is not okay. The worst paint. Is it the worst paint? I don't remember what it's useful for. It has an element of surprise to it in A2. If I remember correctly, I think it's Pawn paint? Oops, I need to turn around. Yes, it's spawn paint. All right, we're saving a little bit of time as long as I don't fuck the strategy up horribly. <sighs> no. No. Wow, this isn't even the strategy that's to be fucked up. That's just me being bad. I haven't even gotten there yet. Oops, wrong way to turn around. I don't know why I have that programmed within me to go to suicide. No, I know why, because I used to do SM first, which is actually kind of nuts. Um, oh boy. <laughs> I was joking. I didn't actually have to fuck that up horribly. Please. Alright, whatever. Oh, okay. Uh, okay. But a distraction nonetheless. What are you hiding? Running through this pretty garden. Ignoring the pain that's all around the real I should just do that. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> yeah, that was good. <gasps> it's a guy! What's up? I don't remember you. That's funny. What's up, my dude? That's disgustingly consistent. There's no excuse for that, honestly. Although, oh boy, I should have stuck with 30 for this. Okay. <laughs> Good shit. Good shit. We're going. We're scooching. We're Nikita Scoocher <laughs> Oh, this is less... Oh my god, please. No. There we go. <laughs> Apparently, I have the inputs programmed. I just need to have them in the right scenario. Please don't do this to me, A6. I, I know, A6, I know. You, you want... You're out for blood. I get it. You've caused me pain and misery in pretty much every single speedrun I've ever done, except for my most recent PB. And now it's like, alright, you got one, now I gotta take the rest of the time from you. And it's like, okay, I get it, I know. Look, can we just, can we agree to disagree? Just let me have ADTF and DE 
with minor to no complications. And I'll be out of your hair, I promise. I'm almost done. <laughs> Look, I know. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I know. You don't like me. I don't like you either. I'm out. Okay. We're good. We're good, A6. All right. Cool. See you later. <laughs> a little brutal. <laughs> oh boy. All right, so we have column paint, which uh, that's statue paint in B1. All right, so yeah, we're making a fucking trip. Aboard a favorite rocket ship. Oh, I should have tried a little bit harder than that. Should have tried a little harder than that. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy. <laughs> nice. All right, cool. And now we just fucking zip and dip. Oops. <laughs> All right, fine. A little bit messy on the setups for that. Do not reset on this one. Because I need one more sigil. All right. Left side. This is an unusual strat. I don't know. I almost never do this. Yeah, there we go. And the left side is stinky. Well, less stinky than right side. But either of those sides are bad, honestly. All right. Look at you, still here. Still persevering against mindless, imaginary obstacles. You're looking for purpose. You seek meaning and reason. Ooh, all right. And rationality in the face of imp impropriety. Was that what the word they was going to say? I don't think that's a good word to use. I don't even know what that word means, honestly. I won't lie. I won't lie to you. I don't know what words is. <coughs> Ooh, sorry. Ooh. Oh, I should have collected the sigil first. Order of operations. All right. <laughs> of course, the first time I try it, I fuck it up. That's all right. This isn't too bad of a backup. Oh, not when I do that, though. Jesus. There we go. A little bit brutal on the beat, too. I won't lie. It's pretty, pretty rough.
Oh boy, that's a high one. <laughs> nice. That delayed jump somehow working every time is the funniest shit. Oops, too far turn. I turned too far. Yeah, so tree paint here is uh, abysmal. Uh, it's it's not what I'd be looking for on a PV, but uh, it's a no reset, so it is what it is. That's that's what we'll say. Comes out when it's out. Now let's move on to the levels that are fast and fun, like before. In this world, you're alone. There's nobody out there to help you. Nobody to share your struggles with. You nut up and you face it. Shia LaBeouf. <laughs> and your phone is dead. Hey, Biaz. Blaz. Biaz. Blaz. Oh, man. I am so sorry. My vision's starting to go. Um, Blaz, what's up, Blaz? How's it going? Yeah. I probably should get glasses for astigmatism, shouldn't I? <laughs> Diaz, I'm sorry. You're great? That's good to hear, it's good to hear. I'm uh, not looking at my splits. It's going good. It's going good. Um, I had a really mad time a couple days ago with stream, and I'm like, all right, let's not do that. And so I'm trying to be less angry, and it's actually working pretty well. I have a second try. That was good stuff. I am not going to lie to you. I'm trying to remember where I know you from, because that's familiar. Your name is familiar. Oh, there you go. First try on that one. Oh, shit. You've been in my streams before? Okay. Then it's, it's probably been a while. Glad, glad to have you back then. That's awesome. Left Do you give up when things get hard? My streaming has only been regular lately no because I've been pushing on... You. On Talos Principle. <laughs> My other problem is that I keep using color as an indicator for people, which is not a good idea. Because the color seems to change every time now. <laughs> but. What's up? I'm glad you are around. I'm trying to keep my mind off the run. You change your color every couple of months. I think people who don't have color assigned get it changed every single time. I think I have my color assigned. I think Ada does too. Ada has teal. I know Ada Goat has teal. And I think I picked some shade of green. Yeah, I believe that happens. Okay. I like the color thing for chat. It's actually really nice. Um... Either being able to pick your own or having it be picked for you. I'm glad they haven't made Twitch chat too complicated for me to follow yet. Someday that'll happen. I think it's just an inevitability, but for the time being, it's real easy to read for now. Although threads are making making it real difficult, actually. Replies and threads. <laughs> I think they remove threads, but I think replies are still around. Okay, six. You this is a smooth run. I don't know how good this is, but it, it's feeling pretty smooth. There's some bumpy bits, but... 
Banana is a magic there area. There's no real reward to be found in this place. But I suppose the idea of a reward is just as a right. for anybody. The banana gets eaten, and nothing is left but. Good. I reset pretty fast on that one. I still remember just about the last frame, and it was a couple of frames into the rotation. Most of the time, I don't get that good. Oops, fuck. <laughs> Oops, shit. No, that's not good. <laughs> All the bits and poles and subs. And Pia. Uh, give me a second. All right. Uh, make it confusing for me, but there's an add on on PC to hide those. Is it BTTV? Or is it um, just better Twitch, I think, is another one? There's a. Sten Deck is a Portal 2 runner, but also he develops things to make Twitch not suck so bad. I'm so bummed about this. <laughs> um, usually it's not this bad for falling onto the sigil. But here I am, broken hearted. Not gonna finish what I started. No, nah, it's a no reset run, we're gonna <laughs> Yeah. I don't know if Stendek runs Portal 2 anymore. I only know him from a Portal 2 run because he did co-op at a GDQ once and I watched it and I'm like, that's so fucking cool. Really? You're not gonna... Ugh. There we go. Alright. Extremely bad B6. Bum bummer B6. Run ruining B6. But it's a no reset and I'm not looking for a PB. I'm just looking to finish runs. That I can know what I need to practice. And it's obvious that I haven't practiced that strategy in a long time. Oof, that was pretty good. Nice. We got the strafing. Nice. Come on, let's finish the trifecta. Let's make this a sexy B7. Yeah, uh, I, uh... Yo, <laughs> that's a good B7. Whew. Yes. Ooh, I kept that boost. Holy shit! Nice! I can almost guarantee that's a gold. <laughs> this area that's looks great. Nothing is ever as it appears on the surface. I guess that's the lesson I want you to take away from all this. You're playing the Talos Prison, a game made by Croton. You got this ad on pack with the voice of Sirius Sam shouting insults at you instead of Elohim. But even that's an illusion. I'm just a guy in the Oh, that's why that's a problem. I'm I keep forgetting that's a fucking thing that I need to deal with is looking up. Oh my god. <laughs> that amount of delay being perfect is so funny. All right. It's serious time. Fuck. <laughs> I need to not say things, obviously, because God damn it. Oh boy. No. Okay, this is apparently also a problem. No. Oh my God, I'm slowly losing my mind. 
<sighs> when it works, it works. When it doesn't work, it doesn't work horribly. Wow. Fuck off. I'm actually starting to get mad a little. Okay, no, no, we're fine. It's... This is just a no reset run. I mean, the run's over. It's it's not going to be a VUE. But damned if I'm sick of fucking things up that I considered super easy, you know? That is so hard to judge. I, I'm almost tempted to pick an easy baby bitch strat just so that I can do that more consistently, but it's okay, you know? It's just going to be another one of those things that I'm going to pick up in practice, obviously. B6, C1. Because when I practice C1, that's something I didn't even think about. I thought about the tree stuck thing. Um, but no, the... Ooh! <laughs> <laughs> the delicate landing. Um, the thing that I thought about first was the thing that probably didn't lose that much time. That's okay. Ooh, wow, that didn't even work? Okay. What? Wow, I need to nose you that? I really should just be using paint, obviously. I think that speaks for... obviously. Hooey, bad C1. Alright. I need to jump this way. No? What? How does this work? <laughs> there we go. I really shouldn't be doing this, but apparently it saves time. That's the problem. So it should be worth it, but it probably isn't worth it too much. Especially if it's going to be costing me time instead of saving me time. I don't know how much time it saves ideally, I guess is the problem. Oh, what the fuck was that? That was close to being a problem. Although, honestly, there might be a boost in here to boost me instead of having to jump over. Oh no. I overthought this. I, I, I fucking had a flashback to the time that this stopped working. And it stopped working again. Rough. Buffalo, 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 no, 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 no. Any damsel that's in distress will be out of this dress when she meets Jim Dress. Okay. C6 I should have practiced, because I need I, I need practice desperately on this. Sometimes we mask that with boasting, but deep down, we all want to make some kind of human connection. Yo! We all have Garbage tree. Or shit tree, I guess. Little nubbin. You know. Little nubbin. Yo. Oh, hey, you can unlock the elevator now. What, you want a cookie or something? Go on, I hear there's bananas on you. <sighs> Not the best C6, but, um,. We're out, and that's the most important part of it, obviously. <laughs> it's okay. This isn't a run that's going to achieve anything, because I already fucked up way too much with B6 and C1. Good morning, Greyhonic! <laughs> What's up? Morning is a little bit preemptive, it's only like 12.20, but you know, I appreciate the sentiment. Unless you're doing that fucking crypto trader thing, in which case get the fuck out of my chat. I, I'm pretty sure you're not, because I think GMGN is a... Uh, that's a... Uh, you're deep in the crypto sort of thing. Oh, <laughs> just grab the thing! That's so funny. Not too much, just got home from your boyfriend's birthday party. Hell yeah, dude. Was it a good time? 
<laughs> well, if you just got home, it must have been super late. Hell yeah, dude. Nah, just normal good morning. Okay. <laughs> you, my friend, have the potential. Oop. Whoops. Yeah, that didn't feel right. I can't see my splits, by the way, Gray. So if, uh, if you would refrain from telling me about my splits, although I don't think you ever really do, which, you know, that's fine. Worse for me. Ooh, an escape room, and y'all succeeded. That's awesome. I should do more escape rooms, but I don't have friends. <laughs> That's such a shit statement to make. I mean, it's accurate, but I mean, like, the last time I did one, it was at ESA. I mean, at ESA it was a good time. There we are. Alright. Ooh, I need to, like... Remember that it's just like UCAG. I need to, or TF. <laughs> See about that? There's a really good virtual escape room. Oh, called Escape Simulator. Okay, is that VR based, or can you like get away with PC only? Oh my God, that is so high. If I could land on that wall that's adjacent, I could almost save time by not having to do this tree jump. But at the same time, if it's less consistent, it's not worth my time. It seems built for it. Oh, weird. You, my friend, have the potential to do great things. I mean that. We've already established that every human on the planet is pretty much the same. <gasps> Holy shit! Out their <laughs> that was the most terrifying moment I think I've had in a while. Um, wow! And instead, I saved time with it. That's super good. I was supposed to grab paint from that so that I could go up again. But instead, I landed on the wall, which is what I dreamed of. I was like, that was the ideal scenario right there. Only $12 with at least 40 levels plus community workshop levels. Interesting. The problem is, if I do it alone, it's really sad. <laughs> oh, shit. Um, I need to turn around for KP. KP, because it's carrier pigeons. Yeah, I don't think that's how that works, Chief. Fair. I mean, I could do them, and then I'd be that sad boy who does uh, keep talking and nobody explodes all on his own, which I have done that before, and it is sad. At least you're not getting judged by an employee. <laughs> yeah, okay. All right. I, I see what you're doing here. You make a convincing argument. I'll buy 50 of them. That was a really sweet jump. The problem is I didn't curve because I was terrified. Oh boy, first try. Also the one game... Far worse than either of us. Oh, I'm sure. Um... The first escape room I ever did, we failed, and it was really sad. Why am I doing this? There's no way that's closer. But it's less confusing. It's a bit sad to do an escape room alone. I mean, it's... So, in my mind, I'm trying to, like, figure out, like, what is it more sad to do? Is it sadder to watch a movie alone? Or is it sadder to do an escape room alone? And I think... I can pretty confidently say, watching the escape room. <laughs> watching the escape room, yeah, we did it. Uh, did I even do everything? I did, okay. All right, then we outie. We outie spaghetti. I watch movies a lot alone. Yeah, but I mean like going to the cinema. Uh, Cause that's one that I've heard a lot where it's like, I'm yeah, if you're going alone, you're kind of a sad side, but a lot than most. I don't know. Frankly, I'm kind of tempted only. to do it now because it would don't mean I could watch movies. Head. Because it's been a long time since I've watched any goddamn movies. Okay. Oop, up, oop, up. Yep, okay. Do you know... Part, the other part of it is, I don't want to ruin the best story that I can ever tell. Which is, if, you know, movie theaters go out of business or whatever, which, like, they won't. But if they were, the last thing I ever watched in theaters 
was cats. And there is something so magical, like so powerful about the statement the last movie I ever saw in theaters was cats. It like grips the soul in a way <laughs> that I don't think I'll be able to uh, get if I watch like fucking a Marvel movie or whatever. Remember where those are, right? <coughs> <coughs> yeah, I don't have a reason to go to the movie theater if it isn't for the people. Yeah. It was just you and three friends. <laughs> so when I watched it, it was on like opening night or like close to it. And so there was a decent amount of people. But it was in one of these special like movie theaters that had super comfy seats. And so it was like massive seat and then a massive gap and then a massive seat. And it was like cheaper than like those seats normally cost because basically I think like I don't think it was like opening night now that I think about it. I think it was just that they needed so little capacity that they used that on the Cats movie. And they were just like, you know what? Fine, fuck it. You get this experience for cheaper than you normally would. Um, sorry, I need to focus on this because this is actually kind of difficult. Or if I fuck this up, I'm going to beat myself up about it more than usual. Alright, I'm good. First class upgrade, essentially. Um, I think I'm good now, yeah, okay. Um, but it was so funny because it was me, my older sister, my younger sister, and my younger brother, and my youngest sister. Or, yes, my youngest sister. And so I went into it thinking, I went into it knowing this is going to be a god awful movie. <laughs> right? But I had, like, no concept of how bad it was. Especially because, like, I've never personally even watched, like, the musical or had any concept of the musical, right? And from the very beginning of the movie, I swear to God, um, I'm losing my mind because I think this is the funniest experience ever. Not because what's happening on screen is funny, but because all of my family members, because I basically roped them into doing this. I was like, let's go watch Cats. I'll pay for the tickets. <laughs> and so I was turning left and right to look at my family as they were mouth agape, terrified at what was happening on the screen the entire time oh my god i have never had such a funny experience as the last however long of the movie where old deuteronomy oh, where old deuteronomy is talking about a cat is not a dog and that's that section goes on for way too fucking long right and a cat is not a dog. And it's just horrendous, right? And it goes on for way too fucking long. And it, you know, it, it doesn't make any sense, especially as people who have never seen cats. Um, and oh my god, you know, okay, I'm going to take this safe just in case this is like a decent run. Mm -hmm. Um and just fucking that entire time because what it was like is every verse was interrupted it was like and a cat is not a dog and then uh, the ensemble and a cat is not a dog and then pause and then it moved on to the next verse and it did it every single fucking time and Hoy Bowdy. <laughs> because it was like um the um the salt and pepper sketch by by um John Mullaney where it's like this section's gonna end soon, right? Right? This is, has to end soon. 
and you're thinking that halfway into the into that part. Anyways, time. Um, what are we looking at here? What the fuck? Was that a PB? Holy shit. I don't know what the time was. It's still the same interventions. 